idea spacers it's Monday I'm checking in with you I've noticed that I have a little addiction for me there's this game that my husband gave me on his uh, on his phone when we were traveling and I was we were on a late flight and I was trying to stay awake and he showed me this this game it's like a puzzle piece game that really forces me to be um, strategic in my thinking and it's a great waste of time especially at a, on an 11 p.m. flight where you're trying to keep your body and mind awake uh, but I kept it on my phone and I found I was going to it a lot and I mean it's one of those things that you can watch a show and be playing this game at the same time uh, I was using it before bed and I was like wanting, I was like drawn to using it all the time. And I wanted to share with you that I've realized like how inert I've been because of it. So I decided I'm just taking it off my phone. And that works for me because when I want it back on my phone, like if I have a long span of time where I'm trying to waste time or I'm trying to just be... Uh, using my brain in a different way I could just put it back on my phone it takes like five seconds and I realized I was also doing this with Facebook and Instagram like using Facebook and Instagram as a way to go you know oh I'm working on my business and so I would poke around on there and so what I did was I set up a limit on my phone for how much time I can spend on Facebook before hi Holly uh, before I can get oh I, I, hi Holly nice to see you I'm wearing the lipstick you gave me um, so I realized like I'm using a lot of these things to waste time and I tell myself I'm doing work like I would play that game and be like oh I'm being strategic no I'm not I'm literally just Fucking around and I was using fa uh, Facebook and Instagram to say oh, I'm doing business but no I mean I, there's a time to use Facebook for business but there's also a time when you're just at the point where there's the point of diminishing returns like there's just no point to it so I wanted to just come on and encourage you to become aware of what you're using that you're telling yourself is for one thing but it's really turning into something else I've been very inert and in Syracuse in March it's really easy to be inert and in February it's really easy to be inert so um, I am just trying to get in more intentional about just continuing action like that that little fish who's just like just keep swimming just keep swimming just like taking small actions every day so my action like I deleted it from my phone and today my husband was getting ready for work and normally I would just kind of sit there and play on my phone I'm like I don't need to play on my phone I put it down I I did a load of laundry, I came down, I straightened up, I got my desk straightened up, like little teeny tiny actions make a big difference. And I'm wondering if there's something that you could do to make a big difference by just taking a small action. Maybe just the small action of putting a limit on your phone for the day or taking off a game that you are telling yourself is helping you but really isn't. Or doing one hard thing, like uncomfortable thing that you know is on your list to do. Because these are the things that steal our time and when we don't have time, we don't reach our goals. So I'd love to know, what is the thing that you do? The game I'm talking about is called Woody. It's the worst name in the world. I don't understand why this thing is called Woody. But um, let me know what your thing is that you could probably switch up and like either remove from your phone or put a limit on or walk away from to do something different that would move you forward. My name is Jen Liddy. I'm an accountability coach and I help busy creative women get their ideas out of their head. I help them create more time and manage their mind so that they can bring their ideas to life. If you are interested in learning how to do this, just follow along here. I always talk about how to create more time because when you master your time, that's how you master your life. Let me know what you're thinking and thanks for checking in. Bye.